Natasha. Debbie. Show. The show. <laughs> Welcome to it. <laughs> Just two patriotic girls. Learning about the world. So please, don't take us the wrong way. And a happy new year. Hello. Okay. Welcome to the oh, Natasha yes. and Debbie show. Merry Christmas to you and yours. Can I stop now? No. No, We're I don't sing. a Christmas episode. I don't sing. So your singing is you totally appropriate. You gotta stop turning stuff on. You know, gotta get sneaky with that button. You Screw it. it. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a no. Now uh, I feel uh, stupid. You were supposed to. They were singing along. No, they weren't. Yeah. They were going, unsubscribe, <laughs> dislike. <laughs> Welcome to the Natasha and Debbie show. Welcome to another Christmas edition episode. Yeah. Tomorrow <laughs> is Magic Monday. You don't want to miss it. You really don't want to miss it. Also, don't you don't want to miss it. <laughs> <laughs> You're reading my mind. Make sure you have that notification bell on so you don't miss out. Make sure to subscribe so that you know stuff. Mm -hmm. And hit the like button if you like us, if you like Christmas, if you want toys, if you don't want Santa to not come to your house. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I don't know. I have nothing. Oh. <laughs> Blenheim Palace. That's what we're doing today. We are. We're going to look at some Christmas decorations. We've been trying to look at different places all over the UK so that we can see decorations everywhere there is. Because when we saw uh, uh, Castle Howard last year, it oh. ruined Christmas in America for me. Yeah, it was so beautiful. Overly classy. Dreamy. <laughs> Overly class. <laughs> yes. Um, we checked out Herod's last week and that was great. But mm -hmm. so, Blenheim Palace, what do we know about it? Winston Churchill was born there. That we know. That's all we know. <laughs> Where is it, Debbie? That's it. It's uh, in the United Kingdom. It's in England. There you go. That's all we know. <laughs> we knew two things. Also, actually, we know three things. It's Palace. You watch this video with us on Blenheim Palace Christmas decorations. This is 2022, though. We don't mm -hmm. have 2023. And I will say, this is uh, we've used this person's video. Uh, it's a Slow Travels family. Uh, mm -hmm. This is the third one we've reacted to. They're really good. Yeah, she they does are a great really, job. really good. Um, mm -hmm. Great videos. Uh, totally love them. So we haven't spoke to them, and hopefully they're cool with this. Um, but we've always put the link uh, to their videos in the description of ours, and mm -hmm. they deserve a gajillion subscribers because they make some great freaking videos. So um, having said that, let's check that great freaking video out right now. Merry Christmas to you. Good morning and welcome back to another episode. Um, quite a different place to yesterday. Yesterday we were in Castleton and it was freezing cold, it was about three and a half degrees and chucking it down. And today I have come down to Oxfordshire to I'm really visit excited about this. Uh, oh, Oxfordshire. Blenheim Palace, which is a spectacular place. Um, I'm really looking forward to their Christmas display this year because they always do such a good job. Now, I was chucking it down on the way on the way here, absolutely throwing it down. And then as soon as I hit Oxfordshire, I've got blue skies and sun again. Um, Perfect. I know, very British of me <laughs> talking about the weather. It is. Um, <laughs> but yeah, quite different. I mean, r well, the past few weeks have been really, really wet up north. We've had yellow weather warnings. Um, up in Scotland, uh -huh. all northern England, Peak District, Lake District. It's cute. Um, so yeah, we've had we've had some bad weather. <laughs> um, but it looks like here in the south, everything is fine. So um, yeah, I'm here today to wander around Blenheim Palace. I will take you inside to see their Christmas display, which is always mm -hmm. one of my favorite. And um, I just want to say really quickly, we were told to do this by a lot of different people yes. to check this out. And so mm -hmm. my expectations are high. Okay, I'm just saying, can it beat Castle Howard from last year? Don't know. I don't know, but I love that video. Mm -hmm. So we'll see. So I have high expectations. I'm very excited about this. They do have a light trail which comes on at night, but Ooh, oh. it's not on today or tomorrow. Um, so I won't be able to show you the light trail, but I will be able to show you inside the house and I will take you around the grounds, which are really impressive. Um, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to this place. It's really unique. It's the only place that has the title of palace um, that isn't a royal palace. 
So it's really? quite, uh, quite special in that sense. Interesting. It was built in the early 18th century. Um, it was, the land here was granted to John Churchill, the first Duke of Marlborough, who um, won the Battle of Blenheim. So Queen Anne gifted him the then ruined manor of Woodstock Ooh. and um, 240,000 pounds, which I think is equivalent to about 25 million pounds wow. today. Wow. So um, he then built this spectacular house on it, which is still going today. It's still lived in, it's still a family home. Oh, really? It is now home to the 12th Duke and Duchess of Marlborough. And um, I think it's probably most yeah. famous for being where Winston Churchill was born. There's a fabulous mm -hmm. quote, actually. That, um, what is that noise? Sounds like sleigh bells. Empty in the bin. I think it's Santa. There's a oh, fabulous quote from Winston oh. Churchill that he took two very important decisions at Blenheim, to be born and to marry. And <laughs> he's very content with both of them. I think something along those lines. Yeah, it's most famous for having Winston Churchill here, and uh, I think also a descendant is uh, Diana Spencer, otherwise known as Princess Diana. What? Anyway, hey. let me stop babbling at you and take you inside. I already love it. Whoa. Holy crap. That's it? Oh my gosh. I didn't expect it to be this big. Oh, it's a palace palace. Yeah, a palace palace. That is huge. I really want to be a duchess right now. Birdie. Aww. I want a bird. Well, that's a tree. Whoa. Look at this place. Are you freaking kidding me? Those elves always freaking <laughs> the crap out. They're cute what? by a little freaky. Is this the Sistine Chapel? It kind of looks like it. So, yeah. you know how you're always asking me what I want for Christmas? I can't get you this. I want this on my ceiling. Okay. <laughs> what are you kidding? <laughs> if only, Debbie. That's beautiful. I love white trees. Do you? The white, all white ornaments. First I'm hearing of this. I do like it. It's, it's very uh, elegant. It's the UK. It's going to be elegant. Of course. <laughs> in a palace. I want to see a tacky Christmas from you guys one of these days. <laughs> it better exist. Can you find the rose in this room? We got to find garden in the mouth. You buy stuff there? Mirrors are freaking me out, man. There is Winston. Whoa, that's cool. Mm -hmm. I want that for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Pop it up. That's pretty. A near deposit. You know, I, I had. Is that how you come back? Yeah. I never really thought about putting roses on a tree, but that's absolutely beautiful. I like that. And we saw that at Harrods, didn't we, last week? Yeah, we did. Yeah. I, I mean, it's. It's not a thing I've seen and here. Especially red roses. I mean, this is really beautiful. It is. And I, I, I like the white like... fake snow stuff, but it's uh -huh. a mess, and I don't like it for that reason. I won't have it in the house. True. But stunning look. It is pretty. I like it a lot. Oh, that's pretty. Wow. 
the other angle just even better. I can't get over the ceiling, this, the, the architecture. And the painting of the mural. Insanely cool. I do like the white decorations too, though. Aww. That's stunning. Ooh. All those roses. Mm. That should be guarded or something. <laughs> right? Wow. Oh yeah, that's that's the stuff right there. Whoa. Mm. Yeah, that's into the text and everything, but I'm feeling the Christmas Love magic that. coming on now. It's getting full throttle here. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, hello. It's like walking through an enchanted garden. Garden of England. I know that's Kent, by the way. Oh, that is like freaking it. gorgeous. I don't know what these signs are for. Some for kids, maybe? Wow, what is this? What? Is, oh, is that, what is that? Is that a sleigh with some? It's not Santa, is it? That is still beautiful. Oh, you have my attention That's now. That's gorgeous. Yes. Oh. Wow. Whoa. This is unreal. Okay, this is why I came here. This is what I came here for. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. That's an elegant tree. It's an elegant room. <laughs> Someone clue us in. I'm lost. Wow. Look at that archway. And I guess that's a dove or a goose on top. That's it's a goose. That's so pretty. Really big dove. <laughs> <laughs> True. Didn't it used to be Christmas goose for dinner? I, I, I want to say right. Luke told us this. <clears throat> I'm calling right. out Luke on Facebook. <laughs> I think Luke told us that. The house is just absolutely <laughs> stunning. I'm watching that behind all the, the Christmas decoration. It's hard to kind of look at everything at once. I'm in love already. Let's see more. Okay, this is... Wow, guys, wow. Oh, that's stunning. Again, my mom would have loved this. Mm, absolutely. Wow. Is that King All Charles II in the background? Or am I crazy? If it is, I'm impressed with myself. <laughs> I don't, I don't typically think of this type of these type of spring flowers I'm thinking of Christmas, right? But it works. Mm -hmm. It's totally different than anything I've ever seen before. Yeah. So totally different. It's anything. really nice how they put all those colors together and like you yeah. said, they do work. Pink, they really do. Coral, purple. It's very pretty and very different, mm -hmm. but I like it. 
Now can you not? I knew there was gonna be something right there. Wow. Well, it sure. is there. <laughs> I feel like a child sometimes watching this stuff. Mm -hmm. I do. Like seeing the world for the first time with your eyes. Yeah. It's a different, it's a different part of the world, so yeah. For us. And I like what I see. Ah, oh, what does that remind you of? Uh, Sleeping Beauty. Sleeping Beauty? Cinderella. Cinderella. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's too Aww. cute. That's my tree right there. The nature this tree. reminds me of my tree. Mine's not as cool as this one, but... Whoa. Ooh, I really like this one. Whoa. <laughs> Last night. Interesting. That is an incredibly cool setup. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> oh, wow. Man, this is all like gone out. Like, yeah. this, is, this is great. I did it up. I love the Chinese lanterns. I like that she's showing us views from all the different directions, mm -hmm. too. Ooh, where are we going? I'm like peeking around the corner. I was doing it, too. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's neat. It's not of sticks. The deer? Looks like it. What? That's cool. You see it with a mantle? Wow. Robins. Birds European birdies. On, British birds. On the antlers. Blue tit, great tit. Sorry, I'm nerding out here. Oh, that is... I need this. Someone steal that for me. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, last year. They won't like... They don't want it anymore. It's from last year. That was awesome. Ooh, the blue room. Yeah. This is like... I know it just keeps going and every room's a little different. Well, a lot different. Mm. A lot. I just... <laughs> wow. Did you guys go to this last year? Let us know. What's the theme this year? Mm -hmm. I don't know what the theme is exactly for this year that we're looking at. What? That's cool. Wow. I like the socks on there. That's adorable. <clears throat> wow. The lights moving with the color. Mm. Wow. This one. Oh, this is really pretty. It's like it's snowing in there. Uh-huh. That's so neat. Look at these. Those are amazing. So much attention to detail. I'm trying to figure out, are they angels? I think they were. But they're weapons. They have weapons. What is this? Oh, they got the icicles I liked it that we can't find anymore. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's pretty. Holy oh. crap. Sorry. Wow. Queen Anne. Oh, come on, right there. Look at that. Mm -hmm. No, go back. Sorry. That is an uh -huh. epic shot. Yes. That is an epic scene. The white sleigh down there, all the trees with the white and the snow. Okay, besides the cool deer with all the birds on it, mm -hmm. that's my next favorite thing. This is this, your favorite this right so here. Far? This is gorgeous. I like the icicles on the trees, mm -hmm. the white and the fake snow on the trees too. Yeah. And then like you saw the white and stuff. It's just a little castle like thing there, and then the fountain. Could uh, you imagine putting all these trees up? Yeah, I could, and I think I would love it. I think I would. You think you would? 
I mean, it's just every ornament has to go in the right spot. Everyone has to look. Of course you can. Yes, you can. It's kind of my thing with archery. <laughs> I'm like, I like doing that part. <laughs> but every tree, every ornament. No, that's a lot. Every room. It takes a lot of people. I wonder how long it takes them to put it up. Okay, I'm sorry. This is just a beautiful view and I can't, I want to take it all in because that is so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're in the movie Frozen. And the fountain is frozen. Don't you feel like you're in the movie Frozen? Yes. <laughs> Feeling really poor right now again. <laughs> wow. There's your view. Yes. That's the other angle looking out the uh -huh. other way. Both. Oh, hello. Is she real? Oh, she's real. Kind of looks like it. I think she's real. <laughs> Polar bears. She is real, right? Yep, she's real. Okay, she's in her hand. Is this supposed to be frozen? I think it is. Maybe. I haven't seen that movie that forever. That is gorgeous. So. Oh, that's awesome. I always wanted a white tree. Mm-hmm, with white ornaments and white mm -hmm. lights. Not now, though. I used to. What is that? That's an organ piano? An organ piano? An organ? One of the two, but I don't know what the <laughs> funny. How beautiful is that, though? This was a taste test. So this was an appetizer. Amazing. This was a sampler. Oh, I hate that. Oh, my goodness. I've just not long come out from inside the... I want to see so much room. more. That's what you can see behind me. And, oh, my God. I'm with you. <laughs> it just blew me away. Yeah. It absolutely blew me away. I think that might be the best display I'm going to see this year. I mean, there's only two other places that might be able to top it, which is Chatsworth House and Castle Howard. Ah. Both of which are on the list, so we will see. But oh my god, the amount of money that they must have put into that. Yeah. Just, mm -hmm. oh, wow. <laughs> I am blown Before she goes on, I just want to ask, should we do a video on just uh, Blenheim Palace by itself? Mm. Let I'm us know more in the comments. The and also Winston Churchill. Please, in the comments, let us know if you'd like us to do those two videos separate from yes. this one. It was spectacular. I mean, the detail was insane. It was uh -huh. so pretty. Which was your favorite room? That I, one. <laughs> I struggled to choose, I think. Frozen one. Anyway, I'm going to get something to eat and I'm going to go across the bridge and I'm going to show you a <coughs> Harry Potter film location. We've never seen them. <laughs> but hello. Choose your load. <laughs> what is this? Like loaded fries. Looks good. Chocolate kisses. Oh, I'm now. I'm really hungry. I'm not I gonna know. lie. We have to get a snack after this. Wow. Oh, look at that. This place is absolutely stunning. Am I yelling? Sorry. Jeez, it's huge. Mm-hmm. So the uh, location that I mentioned is that of the Whomping Willow in the Harry Potter series. So if you've watched any of the movies or if you've read the books, you'll know all about the Whomping Willow. Nope. Now that tree that they use for the inspiration is but here on anyway. the Blenheim Estate. And as far as I'm aware, they filmed the tree and then they added all the CGI and special effects on top of it. Mm. So um, I'm going <coughs> to give you a little glimpse into the Whomping Willow now. You don't need CGI and special effects when you have places like this in the mm -hmm. world. You don't. You shouldn't. It's not necessary. 2007. That's Wow. Stunning. Right. So here it is. So this is a cedar of Lebanon tree. And it's one of the most iconic features here on this World Heritage Site, which Blenheim Palace is. I think it's even a UNESCO site now. I think so since I. the mid 80s, it was UNESCO, I think. Anyway, so this is one of the Whomping Willows. The original one was on the Ashridge Estate and that's uh, Hertfordshire Way. Now, with the yew 
problem. They had, I think there was a load of um, new tree disease going around and a lot of them had to be cut back. So I think Aww. the original Whomping Willow got lost to that. I will mm. need to just double check that, but I think that's right. And this one is used in Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. So it's not used in the earlier ones, but it is used in that fifth film. It's a pretty cool looking tree. She is. Yeah, it is. Fascinating tree. I could live in that tree on that property. Mm -hmm. They've got some ties up there. I was wondering what that was. Extra support. Okay, thought to so. Some of the bigger branches. Hmm. Now, if you wanted to come and pay a visit yourself, you walk along that path just up there, uh -huh. which comes across the bridge, and then you've got the palace there in the wow. background. So, obviously, start at the palace. We'll cross the bridge, that is and you. you will find the Whomping Willow. That bridge is insanely cool. Mm-hmm. Oh, this whole lake is... This is... freaking gorgeous. Peaceful, it seems. Mm-hmm. Very... <laughs> It's like she paid the birds to fly on cue. I'm dusting that one. Right then, well, the sun is just about to set, so it is time for me to head home. I really hope you have enjoyed this short but sweet episode. We I'm have. sorry I couldn't talk you through each of the rooms, but they all had music playing in each room, so purely for copyright reasons, I won't be able to share them. Oh, England. You really do, like... Doggone good job for Christmas. Never disappoint. Mm. It's always. So far you have it. Decked out to the T. We still want to see that tacky Christmas tree that it's has to exist somewhere. I was just, tree? You mean, I want to see the entire tacky area <laughs> that, of Christmas display. Entire in the tacky United decorations. Kingdom. Yeah, I want to see a whole lot of crap. <laughs> I'm serious. We should do the start a YouTube channel of tackiest mm. UK Christmas stuff. It'll be like two seconds long. <laughs> I loved this. It, well, I didn't realize it was going to be such a sneak peek. But then again, I should have. It's a 20 minute long video. Um, but Blenheim Palace, holy crap. Like you said when we first saw it, monstrous. I had no idea it was that well, huge. I, I had nothing in my mm -hmm. head, but I sure didn't expect that. Find out that it's still lived in and um, yeah. occupied. Occupied, that's a dumb word. It's <laughs> not. <laughs> to see that somebody still lives there, that's awesome. It's incredible mm -hmm. and uh again in awe of the beauty loved every bit of it um i don't i thought you know maybe did she say in the description i think i saw that earlier that there was oh okay yeah that was the snow queen was the theme for that year last year's okay. so i don't know what this year's is let us know in the comments if you don't mind um and again did you go to this last year any other year did you mm -hmm. go this year i'd love to know if you went this year um and uh how how much how long does it take to walk through i know she only showed some but I wonder what the full walkthrough is for the Christmas stuff. True. And... Take quite a while just walking down the driveway. <laughs> yeah, well, that's true. <laughs> um, I hope you guys like this. If you did, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to our channel. Again, we have the link in the description of this video to um, to her channel. Mm -hmm. oh, and Well, her video, I should say. The Slow Travels family. They really do have a lot of great videos. Now, we've only watched yes. the ones from her channel that we've done on here with you guys. Mm -hmm. um, but they really do some great great stuff and uh a lot of content so um thank you so much for watching merry christmas i uh, really hope that this is uh you know helping you to get in that spirit Hopefully you're in the spirit and continuing that joyous feeling that we all get this time of year absolutely again thanks so much for watching and for your support we appreciate each and every one of you and we hope you have a wonderful christmas we'll see you before then but until then please love like jazz be as strong as tyson bye bye